Rachel Vigil, and this is our WAC basketball preview for Kansas City. The definition of uncommon is out of the ordinary, unusual. For Kansas City women's basketball head coach J.C. Hoyt, it's about separating yourself, and that's the theme for this year. So our team theme this year is, is uncommon, and so I'm not really a big goal type coach, honestly. We just talk about the process and, and uh, the decisions that you have to make every single day to be in a position to win games. Um, we can be uncommon um, literally in, in every area of our life. And I just challenge my kids um, at the beginning of the year, you know, that only 64 teams in the whole country get to go to the NCAA tournament. And why do we deserve to get to go? You know, what, what um, makes us special that we think that we can just show up and, and make it to the tournament, which is the ultimate goal for everyone. And um, so it just, uh, I thought it was very fitting for the team that we have this year. Picked in a tie for fifth in the preseason coaches poll. The Roos have 10 new players on this year's squad, and Coach Hoyt doesn't know exactly what will happen this season, but she feels good about this hand-picked team. It just feels so good to have my players that I recruited, you know. Um, I mean, honestly, every single player on the team I chose to have there. And um, just to get to, to uh, see that all come together is very fun every day. It's challenging uh, to have to put a, a totally new roster together, but it's so fun. And um, these kids just, they believed in me, you know, they, they believed in my vision and so wanting to give them everything I have and just see how it all comes together. While Hoyt is on her second year leading the ruse, head coach Kareem Richardson is going into his sixth season with the men's team. Still, still get excited. It's, it's funny, I was, uh, I was talking to uh, our women's head coach, JC, and uh, we were just talking about this uh, yesterday and, um, you know, as, as you kind of get, get a little bit older in the as a head coach and things kind of slow down and you, and you can kind of catch your breath a little bit and and uh, it becomes even more exciting about because um, you, you, you kind of learn how to how to uh, deal with all the you know the the other obligations and so then you can kind of just dive into your team and so it becomes that much more exciting for, at least for me that's how that's how I feel about it but yeah I get I get just as excited or even even more excited now. A big change for the Roos this season will be where they're calling home. And after playing many seasons at Municipal Auditorium in downtown Kansas City, UMKC is returning back to campus to play their conference games. Well, it's going to be it's going to be cool. You know, it's uh, get, getting our our, our chan new chancellor, Dr. Agrawal. It was big for him to get student engagement back going on campus, and so uh, moving back to so we're looking for the uh, the pouch of ouch uh, to to get going our student body uh, name from our our mysteriously uh, good football team that that we have going, and so uh, so we're going to ride it out. Uh, the pouch of ouch is what what it's going to be, and and to create that excitement. Um, obviously, it wouldn't be in a a 10,000 seat arena, but but uh, we'll we'll get Swinney rocking and and uh, make it a make it a cool home court advantage. Before they head back to Swinney, UMKC will have to take on Loyola Chicago, the Cinderella team that made it to the Final Four last year. I'm sure you remember, but this won't be the first time that the two teams have played each other. Watching their chemistry and and seeing how together that they were uh, on the floor uh, was, was pretty unique to watch, and so. I really feel that's what we're trying to get accomplished. We played them, played them uh, uh, close. You know, we were we were up at half, and it, it, you know their their experience and that chemistry that I talk about uh, took over, and they, they made some big plays. Um, we opened up the season with them this year, and and uh, so we're going to be tested right right from the jump to kind of see where we are. Uh, it, it's not a make or break either way uh, for our season, but to kind of see where the gauges, see where we are. Uh, and, and what we need to work on and things that we that we are good, that we aren't good at. Uh, so that it, it will be an exciting test for us, for sure. The Roos will open up the season at Loyola Chicago in front of Sister Jean on November 11th. For the Wack Digital Network, I'm Rachel Vigil.